guys, so welcome to the race video. Here we are, the lights are going on, and we're waiting, waiting for the green ones. There we go, the lights out, away we go. So we're trying to give ourselves a bit of a bump start, check around us, make sure nobody's got a better start than us. And uh, yeah, we're going to take a nice defensive line for the first lap, just hit all the apexes, stay inside, don't really give anybody a chance to dive up the inside of us. It'll be slower but at least we can stay ahead for a bit and just cut off all those overtaking angles and then try and get a good drive out of this last corner which we don't get, we just slide around a lot. Yeah, now we're going to take a look behind and hopefully we can uh, keep this going, keep our pace up, start to take our better lines and uh, yeah, just try and gap the guys behind, see if we can pull away a bit and just, yeah, cruise on off like, like a Lewis Hamilton style. So yeah, line's a little bit less defensive that second lap, but still, still not where we were in qualifying in terms of how wide we're taking corners and things. Struggling with that last corner in the start of the race here, um, pushing really hard, trying to stay ahead. And uh, yeah, coming around the second corner here. That's a massive slide. Got that all sorts of wrong proper sideways all the way around, missed the apex, nearly put ourselves in the wall. Same again around that one. And um, I think early on I was a uh, little bit nervous, a little bit a uh, little bit scruffy, a bit scrappy around the corners, a bit too uh, aggressive on the throttle, too aggressive on the steering, just needed to calm down and, uh, and get into my flow and drive how I knew I could drive. I'd set the fastest lap in each of the sessions previous, so I knew I could go around here in theory faster than the other guys and here we go, puts his nose up the inside, I've taken too wide a line, giving him a giving him a way through. So we're down into second and yeah, gonna try and work our way back. As I said in the practice and quality video, there's plenty of overtaking opportunity, so we're gonna try and slingshot round that last corner. But uh, we're too far back. We're just gonna stay on the back here, drive our race. Um, this is Wayne who qualified set, uh, third. He uh, had the inside line into the first corner and that was absolutely king. Unfortunately for, for Lee who qualified second, just gets pushed out wide uh, in those first couple of laps and go back marker. We're going to get past there nice and easy. And then stay on the back of uh, Wayne in front. We get a good drive out of the last corner. Look up the inside. We're going to send it. We're going to send it. We're going to stay there. No, he's going to just beat us around the outside holds on to it so we're, uh, we're having a good battle early here we're giving up the lead but we're, uh, we're fighting hard for it back and uh, a few differences in lines and uh, accelerating techniques between the two of us so a couple of times I'm bumping him into the corners he's bumping me out of the corners and uh, yeah it's all, uh, all fun and games we had a good chat about it after no no hard feelings we've had a great time uh, in this race yeah, you see, I'm making good progress early in the lap. I'm just not getting getting through. I need to make it at the end of the lap, really. Either dive up the inside of this corner here, or uh, kind of go wide and uh, cut underneath him into the into the last corner, coming out onto the start straight. So now we're just going to settle into it. Um, I think there was a bit of chaos behind on the first lap, so we had a bit of a gap. Um, just me and uh, me and Wayne out front here. So just concentrating on, on pushing on ahead, trying to work out where we're going to be able to get past him. So it's a nice tight line right now, gets us a good drive towards the hairpin. We're thinking right, we're looking into the last corner here, get the hairpin right, catch right up to him. Just uh, give him a little nudge, let him know we're there. Try and cut up the insides. Yeah, we're up the inside, we're almost alongside. And yeah, we got the inside line. As I said, the inside line is king, so as soon as you get that inside line, you just force it wide. And then after that second right-hander, that left-hand will really help you out. But he's done a great job, he's cut back underneath me there. Done exactly what I did to him on the last corner, to me on that, that kind of fourth corner there. And um, yeah, we're back into uh, second, unfortunately. So we're going to try again with our kind of slingshot around the last corner. Start catching up. We catch eyes on a back marker. They stay out of the way nicely. And uh, yeah, we're on our way again. So let's see. We're trying to size them up here. Work out where we're going to be faster, where we're going to get past. My main main point is that last corner because we're good through the hairpin. You see, we catch up on the uh, the 
the exit there, we get a good drive. And yeah, just nice late, but he's covering the apex as well. Mate. We've done it to him once, he's wise to it. Might have to find something new. And uh, we're falling really close there, back out earlier than him. But then we, uh, we as it pinches in, we catch right up to him, give him a bump, give him a bit of a gap, and we, we drop off a bit. And then we see a bit of a gap, nothing on there. We apologise to him. We thought he'd made a, made a mistake and we could dive up the inside, but it closes very quickly, the door there. Um, luckily, we didn't spin him out or put ourselves out. And uh, in the end, we lost a load of time. So, uh, Wayne ahead has, has pulled away a little bit. So again, just getting my head down, putting in the clean laps. Trying not to slide around too much. Trying to settle into it. Yeah, by this point, we're, uh, we're calming down a bit trying not to make any ragged mistakes and there we get a great exit out of the hairpin we're right on the back of it again we're going for the wide the cut under but he takes the corner beautifully and uh, it just gaps us a little bit so then we're gonna focus again on catching up give him a good nudge there again as i said there was uh, plenty of bump in both ways in this one we were both cool with it uh, neither of us doing it maliciously or trying to take each other out or anything just a difference of lines and styles and uh, yeah, sometimes you get a bit close, I haven't done much racing, kind of bumper to bumper. So predicting that is still an art I'm trying to learn. We get a good drive out there, and are we going to try and bump it along? Yeah, we squeeze through, and we're back in the lead. So we've just slowly, slowly gained on and kept our lines good. We've managed to close them off that time from, from getting pa back past us. So now, back in the lead, back marker coming up, we're just going to carry on we're going to try our absolute hardest to stay ahead so we take the inside line just because the back back is there and uh, that helps us close the door from behind as well so now yeah we're back just onto quality laps now just fast controlled steady just don't give don't give them a chance to uh, to pull back up and, uh, and mug us up the inside again it's got us twice into that fourth corner so we don't want to we don't want to give anything up there and um, yeah just trying to cover off the apex here not hitting the apex very much on that last corner um, i think i was still a bit too eager to get on the throttle and the back end just wasn't gripping but yeah so we're just thinking now where the lap board was uh, on the last corner you probably won't see it many times in the video because it just cuts out the shot just to come around the corner but yeah keeping an eye on that every lap just trying to see how much longer we've got left, how long we've got to hold on for, and uh, yeah, just pushing on basically, really getting in the flow of it now, that was nice around that uh, second corner, really got that good that time, and that gives us a, a nice, nice bit of uh, gap behind, as we can see, coming up on some back markers now. How are they going to do? Are they going to gonna be nice, nice to us, get out of the way? Or are we going to have to fight our way through? Might lose loads time here. As we saw in the absolute kite video, sometimes the back markers can be a real pain. Uh, not on purpose, but just because it can be hard to overtake. Uh, this one, though, it's a bit easier to overtake. But it gets all squirrely. We go to go around the outside and actually costs us a bucket load of time. Um, Wayne was right on us then. He, he was ready to paint not quite close enough to get through you can see i'm taking a look over my shoulders here he's right on us we're taking the defensive inside line we're confident we can go flat out around this section past the back marker which we do manage and we're thinking right push on we're a bit wide there uh, another back marker but that one gets out of the way nice and gently for us and um, yeah we're we're starting to feel good at this point track looks clear for a lap or two ahead so um yeah we're getting getting into the meat of the the lap now you probably saw the lap counter there um can't see it in my little preview screen but uh yeah we're getting towards the end getting that second corner really nice now really happy with how we're apexing on that one um, this one again yeah nice so back marker not a great point but actually i think we might catch them at the last corner we're gonna be good here Maybe they take a very tight line inside and we just sweep up and that's the checkered flag and that is a victory for us. Um, started pole, finished first.
dropped down to second for a bit in the middle, took it back for a couple of corners, dropped back down to second again. Um, a great race. Me and Wayne had an absolutely fantastic back and forth. He never let up on me. Um, the time absolutely flew by. Those 20 laps felt like nothing at all, just concentrating the whole way. Um, and yeah, put into the pits here. Feeling pretty good. And uh, give Wayne a thumbs up. Fantastic race. We'll have a little chat about it. And uh, you can see we're both just hyped. Just can't, can't believe how much fun it was chatting about trying to go down the straight as fast as we can. Um, and just, yeah, unfortunately for Wayne, I just seem to be getting a good drive out of that last corner and just having more top end speed around that flat out section to take the inside line. And um, yeah, great stuff, guys. Cheers for uh, checking out the video again. Okay guys, so we've got the results up on screen here. As we can see, I took the victory. And my fastest lap was a 27.660, so that was even faster than my fastest practice lap. Um, as you see from the chart, just steadily getting quicker as the race went on. A couple of uh, bad laps um, where I just made a mistake or two, caught some back markers, the usual stuff. Uh, Wayne in second and Lee in third. Ash had made up a few places, but uh, I think he got hammered into the wall as he uh, as he put he got got taken out um, unfortunately for him but um, yeah hopefully we'll see him at the front uh, overtaking me again like he did in the absolutely karting video at some point um, a really fantastic race really enjoyed it all the uh, guys and lady there were absolutely fantastic and um, yeah the track was really interesting really enjoyed it lots of overtaking opportunities it was nice and wide. Um, so yeah, good fun track to drive. Can't wait to uh, go back again. So that's uh, that's it for the video. Um, got maybe a couple more practice sessions coming up. No races planned for the immediate future. Um, but yeah, hopefully some more soon because I kind of got the, uh, the bug now for the races. Really enjoying it. Really enjoying challenging other drivers and um, yeah, just putting my skills to the test and uh, seeing where I end up, gradually improving. Um, and yeah, we'll see, we'll see how I go in the next one. So thanks for watching guys, really enjoyed this race. Um, really hyped to have uh, won the race, really enjoyed it, good battle. And uh, cheers to Wayne for a really good, good uh, friendly fight. Um, yeah, fantastic stuff. Thank you very much for watching again and I'll see you next time.